guys, hi friends. So, um, I just recorded a bunch of videos and I realized I could just save this and get it over with quickly because I literally have 7 minutes and 23 seconds of storage left. Um, so yeah, I have so many stuff. Um, like, oh, journaling stuff and like stickers and stuff because I am obsessed with stickers and I never know what to use them for. I got this journal at Michael's and I'm gonna use it for a senior journal, like, I'm gonna decorate it for senior year because it's my last year of high school and it needs to be the most fun and important one because I've never been to a football game before and I have so much stuff and I'm gonna use whatever I need from here and I will show you along the way as I go. Also at Michael's. I was gonna make a summer journal, but, um, girl, empty. Like, I literally, yeah, that was Niall Horan, if you don't know who that is. He's from One Direction. I went to see him in concert. So now I'm gonna turn that into a concert journal or I might change it to a different journal because this is giving summer got these at five below everything else mainly michael's and hobby lobby and amazon i got that at um staples don't forget i also got this at five below they're cute little daily affirmation cards there's 54 they're so cute like stay weird yes um welcome mm -hmm. always needs love like you know stuff like that some of them are really corny but i mainly just use the ones that aren't corny like it's nice to be nice that one's kind of corny like obviously it's nice to be nice who would want to be mean okay be groovy or leave me in. Like, I like that one. And I'll also add them. Oh, 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 okay. They just exploded on me. When you look inside it, the first two pages are like this, which I don't really care because I'll be putting pictures over it. Then, as you keep going, there's dots. I love it when it has dots because if you don't have paper to put in the background, you'll have this cute dot. And it's just like that the entire book. And I'll just glue pages, decorate it. So I'm just going to show you all my scrapbooking supplies and then I'll tell you where I got them from. I got this at five below. It was five or four dollars, I don't remember. It's like pages, you can rip them up, cut them cute, so you can glue them on the pages so that they're not boring. It just comes with orange, like this swirly thing, purple, flowers, and blue, and this thing. This I got at Michael's as well. It was five dollars because it was on sale. So I had to get it because it's butterflies and I like this. It has like so many different stuff, it's so cute. Oh, I thought it had more designs on the back, but yeah. Then I found this at um, Goodwill. It was like, I think also $5. Like most of them were cut, but I also cut some of them because I was like, I need this. It's not that cute, but the only one I probably use is like this or like dots. You know, probably this. If like, I ever go to the beach, I can put that as the background. Oh, four ninety nine, yeah, $5. You don't necessarily need fancy paper like this. I just wanted to because it's my last year. I have to go over the top. Um, you can literally get colored paper from the Dollar Tree, Dollar General, Walmart, Target for like much cheaper. Like, you can get, like, one with different colors. Like, red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple, pink, black, brown, and white, and gray for, like, a dollar. And it'll come with, like, probably half as much as this. Then I have these daily affirmation cards. I got them at five below because I thought they were cute when I could use them. They say, like, little cute words, like... Oh, my gosh. This is a struggle to open with one hand. It says stuff like plant love and kindness. Um, um, give me a second. I have to get them out. Keep smiling, stay positive, smile. You know, cute stuff like that. They're so cute. You should probably get them. It was... I don't think it was five dollars. I think it was probably two or three dollars. Less than five dollars. That's for sure, because it's a keychain. Then I have like a, a like a bunch of glitter. I got this years ago at the Dollar Tree, and in the containers they sell them at Dollar Tree, and I put them in there because they came in little bags like this, and it's so annoying because when you open, you can't close it again. So I put them in here. These I got the jars at the Dollar Tree too, but the little beads inside, I got them at. Hobby Lobby because like you use them for resin. Um, yeah, these stamps, my goodness, these stamps, I got them from Michaels. No, these? I think I got them on Amazon. They're like different colors. And then these I got at Michaels. These two I got at Michaels such a long time ago. Like when I was in elementary school a long time ago. This I got a couple years ago. It was not $3.99. It was like a dollar. I got it on sale a couple years ago. And then this stamp thing, I got it from elementary school. I mean, like since I was in elementary school. Elementary school, sorry. Tongue twisters, guys. I have two minutes left. My goodness. These are the papers I separated for the book. Camera. My mom got it. Paper from my art teacher from uh, middle school. Um, this book. Target, I want to say. Bunch of these things. I don't know. Probably Target or Walmart. No, I think it was from Walmart. These I got them from Amazon because I, like, use beads a lot. These stamps. They just sell them at the Dollar Tree. I wish they had more. I got these at elementary school, too. When I was in elementary school. That's the other journal I got. Um, Amazon. And five below. I love these pens. They're so cute. I got this at the Dollar Tree. It's like a sticker book. It came with stickers specifically for this book. So you stick them in and at any time you can take them out and you use them for whatever. Got it at Dollar Tree a couple years ago. Then I have these 
tweezers. I got them on Amazon because my dad kind of ruined mine. <laughs> mine was an accident. Not really. There are tools to make jewelry. One cuts, one does loops, and another one does something else. I have this cute book. This isn't the cover. It's this. this. It's a good day for a good day. I got Michael's a couple years ago. It was like a dollar or two. And I want another one, but I don't know where they sell them. Probably a pineapple sticker from the dollar, a cutout of like these chocolates that my mom eats. Okay, I love this because every time I find it, I'm shocked that I have it. It's a Percy Jackson poster from the book set that I got. My mom actually bought. I don't know if I'm, I'm probably gonna frame it and put it on my wall somewhere. I just don't know how, when, or where. Amazon, or not Amazon, my mom got it, but I'm assuming she got it on Amazon. It's not that great to be honest. These little cutouts from the Dollar Tree. This from Target or Walmart. I think it was Walmart. These are some papers that I got from my art teacher in 8th grade. Moana stickers from... I don't remember. I think I got them at Hobby Lobby because they were like a dollar. I don't remember where I got this, but they're cute and I use like absolutely none of them because of how cute they are. I'm scared I'm going to waste them in a bad way. I don't know where I got it, but it's cute, guys. I love it. I got this at Target. Like, if you make your own stickers. Um, I don't use it much because I thought it was going to be something else, but... Yeah. Sticky notes I got from this brand called Mr. Pen. They make really good sticky notes. I own, I get sticky notes every year, but this year I had leftovers, so I'll use the leftover ones. These tweezers came with this pack of floral thingies. I'll show you later. We already went over this. I do well. Um, I don't know. Probably from Dollar Tree, the sticker. Um, again, Mr. Pen is my like favorite school supply brand. Mr. Pen highlighters. I hate this one because it doesn't look like green, and I hate this one because it doesn't look like purple, but the rest is amazing. I love it. Then from, oh, this one's also from Michael's. This is how I decorated the inside of it. Like, you just put stick. I don't do this side because I don't know. Um, this is how I decorated the inside, and this is what the inside looks like. Yes. I would definitely use these. I haven't used them yet, but I would definitely use these. I color coordinated them. I'm definitely using these for what I'm doing with this book now. These are a bunch of random stickers I have collected over the years, and I cut them all and put them in a Ziploc bag because they were getting annoying. So we'll have to go through that. Then I have this. I have to go through that too. Um, Bella is like amazed by what she's looking at. Then I have a bunch of stickers from Walmart a couple of years ago. They went on sale randomly. Here's the Secret Life Pets. Ten cents. Like, imagine it was, um, it was a dollar, but... So it was originally 98 cents, and it turned out to be 10 cents, and it's for people who are older than three years old. And this is the inside. I used something. Bella's like, I'm still four. So I can have that? Yeah, but it's mine. It's the same stickers. But, yeah, I don't know why I didn't take more. 10 cents? Come on, that's crazy. Um, oh my gosh, I used to have a whole, like, millions of these trolls stickers. We have Branch and Poppy. That's it. But I used to have a butt ton, a buttload ton of these. Then minions, despicable me. Minions, minions, minions. It's the same page. Then these were 50 cents. Sometimes I give them to this girl whenever she behaves, right? Let them see your boogers. Your boogers, you. Okay. Then I have this. Oh, why does it have a line in the middle of it? Okay, I think I was Don't saving. Was so no. Okay, yeah. Ridiculously cute, absolutely necessary, crazy, fabulous, awesome, stellar, cool, phenomenal, phenomenal stickers. Series one. That's crazy. So many stickers. Um, we'll see what we can use. Spring break. I'm definitely using that. Um, definitely using not those. Um, but I'm definitely gonna use the school related ones since it is my last year. Oh my gosh, crazy. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna use that for tomorrow. No, I'm not. That's a lie. Um. I'm gonna put them, I'll probably cut them out. I got these at the Dollar Tree when I was in elementary school. I still have them. I, this is about my elementary school. My elementary school. When I was in elementary school is where everything started with me being obsessed with stickers, which is why I have so much. I have a lot more, other than this box, by the way. We'll go through those later. This I got at the Dollar Tree this year. Don't know oh, okay. why. Then we have Stitch, Hobby Lobby for $1.99, same thing, elementary school, elementary school, fruits, valentines. If you want a closer look, make sure to tell me, I'll definitely give you the closer look, 
stickers, stickers, stickers. Okay, these are the other ones I got from Walmart that were on sale. Oh my gosh, these are stickers that I have from this One Direction book I used to have. I love this Louie, I love Liam. I had a Zane one, I don't know where it went. Oh, I think I decorated um, with my minions with it, because Zane loves minions. Um, there's Louie and Liam, I don't know where Harry and I went, but yeah. Love them, I will cherish them forever. Mm -hmm. 50 cents for minion stickers is absolutely crazy. No. Um, fancy stickers, probably the Dollar Tree. I have whatever's in here, I don't even know. I got these at Five Below. When you scratch them, they smell yummy, like strawberries. Um, this came with, it was like a free gift with the highlighters, I think. A Mr. Pen must have. It was like the first order you get if you email them, they'll send you these. I never use them because they're so cute. And I never need to paper clip stuff. Then these are to make your own stickers. That's the same thing as the other sticker book. Smiley face stickers, Toy Story stickers, Lion King, oh no, food stickers, Lion King stickers. Oh, these have jokes too. Um, Guardian of the Galaxy, they're scented too. And Scooby Doo stickers. So I have these two little cases. I got them from my mom. I have no idea where she got them from. Probably Dollar Tree or Walmart. Um, I have these cases. They're insanely skinny. Like they're like the skinnier than my finger. Like literally. I have two of them. I have a blue and a white one. And if they, I put stickers in there too. I literally have so much stickers in each of them. Like I think these are the washi tape ones. Yeah. And then these are like the normal ones. Cause like my nails. I did them. I love them. Okay. Look. Yes. I think I use the washi ones more. I'm not sure. This, I already went through this one, and I realized that I didn't record, so this is all I got for each of them. I'm not even going to use all of them. I'm going to use, like, probably just this one, this one, one location thingy. And then I got appointment, so I can put one my appointment to get my braces off is. Which is sadly going to be the last time I ever really get checked out early of school. It's so sad. Oh my gosh. Okay. I'll probably choose, like, the purple or the white or the teal. Or, like, some cute color, you know? And I literally think I got all of those from the Dollar Tree. So if you see stickers at the Dollar Tree, get them. Because they're cute most of the time. And um, these are just the washi tape stickers. So let's see what I need from here. So I have to use this backpack. Look how dirty it is. Every time I wash it, these things will not come out. My mom sprays this thing on it. It's literally black because I sweat. Hello? I tried to embroider it, but it don't work. It is disgusting. And on the inside it is as well. Well, the inside is a lot less worse. Sunglasses. But you can see how dirty it is. Oh my gosh. But I have to use it. Because I don't have anything else. So, get my backpack ready with me. I'm taking Pure Tutor, English 4, yearbook. And she's going to change it to office assistant so I can work in the office. It's not a class. I don't get anything from it. But, for my English class. Oh, Pure Tutor class? I didn't need anything. She said she had everything in her house. Okay, fine. That's perfect. So, for English 4, she said I need paper and binder, which I have. Pens and pencils, I also have. Highlighters, I also have. They're literally right here. And two composition books. Two composition books and a binder is a bit much, lady. I'm not bringing all of that crap. I'll bring one. You're getting white, not two. You're getting white. Anyways, that's it. She has a bunch of rules, but they're literally the school rules. I don't know. Then I have journalism and yearbook. I need a pencil, an SD card, a folder. Composition notebook. Imagine three notebooks plus a binder. It's pretty crazy. That stuff did not fit in my backpack. And a glue stick, which is perfect. I have all that stuff. So, my grandma gave me this pencil pouch when I was in seventh grade. And I still have it. It's like chunky. I threw a bunch of stuff in here. It, she got it on Amazon because my favorite color was yellow at the time. Um, how did I empty this out? To be completely honest, I'm throwing everything in the wash right now, including my backpack. I'm, I'm emptying my pencil pouch as well. Pencil pouch is so big that it has this in it. Oh, I need to get those out. It has this, this, this is dirty from pencils and pens that have exploded. All of these. It's a whole bunch, too. Oh, yeah. They might not look like it, but they fit on the top. And all of this mess fits at the bottom, which is perfect. And you can adjust it so that you can make it smaller. 